Life gives us choices at every stage. Fellow Toastmasters and honored guests. My name is Tokir Ahmed and I was born in 1994 in a small village of Pakistan, which is called 304 GB. Yes, it is a number. Why is that? I will discuss in my next speech. This village is located near the center of Pakistan and 10 times smaller than Nicosia. Most people are farmers and live very basic lives. There I received a basic education including my English introduction. A for apple, B for ball, up to so on R. Because R had only one meaning for me. Run from school. Where? Who cares? Just escape. As I grew up and enjoyed my childhood, I also watched my wider family gradually destroying itself. My father had seven brothers and they increasingly argued with each other as poverty took control of each family. <clears throat> By the time I reached the age of 11, a big family house had been divided into seven small pieces. Mm -hmm. At that stage, life gave a choice to my father. Either he could fight for his piece of property or he can leave the house for others and move on. If my father had chosen to stay, I would have to spend my life in a small village with small ideas and with small dreams. But thanks God, my father had chose to take us with him to his army base in a large city. This step gave me a chance to get a good education in good schools and also showed me the another part of the world. And I started building my new ideas and new dreams for my future life. Four years later, my father got retired from the army and started a business. I finished high school and life gave me a choice. Either I could follow my father's footsteps and join the army as my family tradition wanted me to do, or I could take a risk and continue my education as I wanted to do. I decided to go against my wider family decision and continue my education. My this decision exploded in my family like a bomb. Everyone get mad at me. They thought I missed a big opportunity. But only my father supported me at that stage. I took a big step and stood against my wider family. Unfortunately, even though I started my education in a university, very soon after my father's <laughs> business collapsed. Then due to lack of money, I was kicked out from the university. My dreams were destroyed and I was again the target of my wider family. Life gave me another choice. Either I can give up my dreams and go back to my family tradition or find another way to fulfill my dreams. At that stage, once again, my father helped me, but with an agreement. He would help me to get out of Pakistan for my education, but once I got out of Pakistan, I would get no help from my family at all and I have to face my future by myself. Fast forward four years, my father had invested a huge amount of money in me and 6th of February 2015, I arrived in Larnaca airport with big suitcases and big dreams. I didn't know that the real life challenges were waiting for me in Cyprus. Very soon, I found that my college degree is a non credited and I had wasted my all of father's money. Once again, I had to choose my way. Life 
gives us many choices at every stage. I had shared some of my choices with you. And I don't know how many are waiting for me. But I will continue my journey until I reach my destiny. Until I find what I want. And I am ready for all kinds of challenges. Thank you very much, Mr. Chairman.